not in my cooking clothes. <laughs> no, you are, you're in the perfect cooking clothes. Here we are in Newton, Massachusetts, and we are about to embark on a beautiful journey of uh, Italian tradition for Easter. We have the very beginning of a pizza rustica, but we have John, who is the rustica master, and he is going to be doing all the cooking. I'm just going to be documenting it. So the first step, obviously, is he's making the dough. Can you tell us a little bit about the rustica and your tradition in the dough? The, the recipe came from my grandmother on my mother's side, Maria Santa De Vito Guarino. And uh, this is the recipe uh, as translated by my uncle Anthony. And it's uh, three pages long, or actually five pages. It's a very long recipe. And uh, with a major error that was fortunately corrected because it calls for 16 cups of flour and four quarts of water. I quickly realized that that was not gonna work. So we changed that to four cups of water and that's what we're about to do. And we're gonna add the yeast. Excellent. Eleven dough. Throw that off, and then you get points. Mozzarella. I did something. Get a better I don't think so, but I'll keep looking. <laughs> oh, I must have missed it. Mistaken the one. At this point, we're going to let the dough rise. I don't know how long. What's going on? It looks like your dough's forming there, John. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lovely dough ball. <laughs> two hours. Oh, one and a half, two hours. Okay. So, at this point, we're going to let the dough rise. And it's supposed to be covered with three linen towels and a blanket. <laughs> so, I'm going to get a hold of some linen towels here. And we'll cover this with some linen towels. I think I'll pass on the blanket, but uh, yeah. this is going to keep this nice and, nice. nice and rested for two hours. Two hours. Two hours. Yeah. <laughs> Doubling. 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 Okay. Doubling. Doubling what? Doubling. Wow. What's happening, Rustica Master? <laughs> well, we're about uh, two hours since we last met, and I'm about to uncover the dough and see how it's done as far as it's rising. Oh, it has oh, risen wow. beautifully Look. under the under the linen towels. Would you say that that is doubled in size? Uh, I think that's about doubled in size. And now we're going to divide this in half. One for the bottom and one for the top of the pizza rustica. Beautiful. What are we getting? Come on down. is a mixture of ricotta, pepperoni, oh. ham. Wow. Pepperoni, ham, egg, egg. ricotta. Mixture. It's soaked overnight? Well, if you do it overnight, sure. Just a few hours in advance. Yeah. A few hours of soaking. Hi. Provolone testing. Yeah. Provolone testing? So we'll do passes. Passes. It's, it's a pass fail? Pass fail. Pass fail. And then which meats do you want to start with? Uh, one of those. One of these? A stack of the salami. Italian dry salami. Uh, roll out the dough and put it in the pan and covered the dough with a layer of no, Frankie. egg white and water whipped together and then put a layer of cheese and now Provolone. we're following that and up mozzarella. and then we're following up with a layer of a Genoa salami. Nope. Wait. So we have various cheeses and various meats that will be going to the rooster cut, correct? As, correct. As the dogs. Quite a variety. And into us as well. Yeah, small bites. Mozzarella? And how many years have you been making a rustica? Oh, uh, mm, good question. Uh, at least 10. I think at least 10, right? At least 10 years. More. More than 10 years. 20. 
20 Prosciutto? years. 20 years. Uh, Do I hear 25? No. 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 Now. no. Well, perhaps huh? prosciutto, and then we'll do some of that mix. Yes. Let's do some prosciutto next. Prosciutto. This, Here, the recipe you. doesn't really call for prosciutto, but that's all right. Yes. Oh. oh, this big monster spoon. Yeah. The recipe doesn't really call for prosciutto, but that's all right. The 20 pounds. <laughs> Closer to 20 pounds. Uh, I have a feeling, such a based good. on the layering that I'm seeing here, this is going to be pretty hefty. So we're selling it per pound in Epicure? Yeah. <laughs> Grandma, Grandma Maria's Rustica. Eat some Look. sliced meats. Eat sliced meat and also figure out what's going to be the very top layer. Let me call and That's see good. if we can get you okay. an appointment. And then these guys. Here you want this. Well, well, of course I have no nails at this That's point. That's all right. Here. Are okay. you going or you're not doing your own? I went to the, the walk-in place, but yeah. you have to drive there. Yeah. This place you can walk to. Yeah. Um, it's called... I think it's called... Yeah. Oh, okay. All right. Walkable right. little village here. I know, I know. And done? Oh, yeah. yeah. That's heavy. That's heavy. We got right, a 15 right. pound of the water. Oh, oh that's right. gorgeous. Oh, wow. Yeah. Wow. Quite skilled. Boy, Fabergé had nothing on you. I know. So you the first one. What did you make? I did four. Oh, good. I, I almost got you. Mwah, 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 mwah. What do you think, Mr. Fur Mittens? This has got to be presentable, ma'am. <laughs> I didn't start yet. I'm waiting for the rest of the dog. <laughs> Hello. Checking on the grounds. Checking the ground, soaking the uh, here to oversee each of the wood chips. I'm gonna see if I can propagate a beech tree. Uh -huh. We've tried that many uh, times. No, you have to get a beech tree propagated and then try and keep it alive, which yeah. I still can't do. Yeah, the rustica is really taking shape. The rustica is now getting its glaze of egg yolk and water mix. Final step on the pizza rustica we have just glazed the top with egg yolk, and now we're going to put it in a 300 degree oven for one hour. Bottom rack. Bottom rack. Very important piece. <laughs> Wiggle it. It brings you joy. Okay, now I need to stick a butt out. So what is that? So this is a ricotta uh, tower. Be N -S -A -D -O. Whoa! N -O. You are very skilled. Miley. It works. I think you being okay, a chef is your, is your third life. <laughs> third life. Vicky's handling the cheesecake. Okay. She's got the cheesecake. Yeah, she is the queen, oh. queen of the cheesecake. Four down. Just, uh, you know, substitute removal is, of the rustica. Because my dad's out driving the GTO. Oh, dang, the GTO. Oh, dang. Okay. Wow. Six across. They hit the sauce a lot. You know, it's, you know it's done when you get this. A whale constantly. That's what you're looking for? Oh, nice. Beautiful. 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 We are going to attempt to flip the pizza rustica okay. onto this wooden cutting board. In order to Swift. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah. Deep pan. Flip again. And then we're going to reflip. Reflip, right? flip, flip. Deep flip to we flip. Look at Stella Shark. <laughs> Stella ready? ready to go. Just in case you miss. Mm -hmm. They're ready to help. Woohoo! No All leakage? Right, wow! The double flip was successful. Well done. Now she's giving it a little kiss. Sniff. A little snip. Looks beautiful. 
Wow. <laughs> oh, Huckleberry. What you were doing? Yeah, right, yeah. Yeah, that's true. Whenever he's whenever we see teamwork where you you never actually make a straight line. So yeah. that you know everyone that the next person can person come and straighten up the line. Yeah. Right, right. Yeah. 24, Angie, star. I'm like, you guys can't have a big old shit. You accept, pig? I'm now one of your, one of your, one of your pets. She's yeah. You're part of the pack, too. Yeah, you you part of the pack, squid. What do you think, pig? She's like, keep rubbing my ears, lady. Oh, Dad. You funny.